I mean, look at this now. Just look at it. Just, just look at it. It's pretty darn disgusting. <laughs> Brothers and sisters, and welcome to MTG Malone with me, Matches Malone. Thank you all so very much for tuning in. I hope you're having the most wonderful freaking day. Uh, this is one more video from the early access event. So, if you have been there during the live stream, thank you very freaking much. I really, really appreciate it. It meant the world to me. We were over 200 people for so many, like, so much time during the live stream, but we were all, always, almost over 150 people all day long. So, that really means the world to me. Live streams will be here very soon, more often, so uh, yeah, maybe happening right now while you're watching this, who knows? <laughs> I don't think so. But hey, it might be happening. Uh, the new set is absolutely amazing, as you might have seen during the live stream. So enough with the yammering! Let's get into the cat attack hammering! We're playing cats! Oh, the goodest cats of them all! We're playing token, freaking, pump spell, freaking everything. It's just... This deck comes out of nowhere. So, why is it cat attack? Well, there's one, two, three, three cats in here. And that is more than enough to call it cat freaking tribe. So, here we are. Sovereign, Okinek, Ahau. This card is crazy. It has War 2, which is super good. Uh, it's a 3-4 for 4, so yeah, and a Noble. Maybe you need that for your Noble deck, I don't know. Uh, but whenever it attacks, each creature that has more power than its base power, you put 1-1 one, one counters on it equal to the difference. So, if you, for example, have a Gala Greeters that has three counters on it, you put another three counters on it. It doesn't look for counters, it just looks at different base power. So, why is that so good? Because it only looks at power. So, together with Jetmir, that is absolutely insane. I would put this in my Jetmir Commander deck, not even a question about it. Because Jetmir gives power to the creatures. So it gives up to three power to your creatures, so you get three counters freaking on it. So yeah, together with the Gala Greeters, you know, Gala Greeters also gives itself power. The wedding announcement pumps up the team. It is just very darn freaking good. So we also have the Elspeth, you know, giving counters. So it will grow this even bigger. Uh, the Virtue of Loyalty, you know, gives counters at end of turn. So all of your creatures will be freaking bigger than they should be. Same with the Invasion of Gobokan, you know, let's go over the old cards very quick. Um, you know, it also pumps up the team, so it is very darn freaking good. So, we also have the Kutzil Malamed Exemplar. Uh, with this, you are protected during your turn. So, uh, opponents cannot cast spells during your turn, which is super darn good. So, they cannot use removal during your turn, which is good. They have to spend their mana during, you know, their turn. And whenever a creature with e uh, one or more creatures, so, if you attack with four creatures, it only counts one, we're not in commander here. Uh, with power greater than its base, power deals damage, you draw a card. So, that means, if your Jetmir is out, now they all have trampled, now you will draw a card. Pretty darn freaking good. Um, another new card that is absolutely bonkersly insane in this deck is Animpakal the Thousand Moon. Uh, whenever you attack with one or more non-gnome creatures, these are the gnomes, by the way, you put a 1-1 counter on it, um, and then you create X-1-1 gnome artifact creature tokens that are tapped and attacking, where X is the number of 1-1 counters on it. So that means you play this turn 3, you attack in with your Kutzil, for example, now you put down a counter, you get a little gnome, you know, later on Jadmir will make this even freaking bigger, so you will get a lot of counters, is what I'm freaking saying. So when you attack with these two together, you will put the counters on it first, then make the gnomes, you know, or you make the gnomes, then put the counters on the gnomes. Whatever you want to do, it's explosive. It just escalates so freaking quick, and out of nowhere you're just dealing 45 damage or whatever. It's absolutely freaking insane. So to guarantee that we get a lot of freaking creatures with this, we have the wedding announcement, we have even the rebel rousing here, and we have the Galta and Marvin. Just we have only one, just you know, for the freaking heck of it. And oh, Jared Tuck, the deepest foundation. Whenever you would make a token, you create three times that many tokens. That means if you attack in with your rebel rousing, well, you have four creatures. Now you're making twelve tokens. 
Is that over the top? Yes. Is that amazing? Yes. <laughs> and when it dies, it comes back as a land that you can flip back to Ogier Tuck. Uh, if you uh, attack with three more creatures this turn. Uh, I mean, it's good, you know, it's just, it stays on the battlefield, is what I'm freaking saying. We also have King Darien here, so we can give all of our uh, tokens, also, you know, it pumps the tokens, very important for the Sovereign, and, you know, it can give your tokens hexproof and indestructible until end of turn, which can also be good. Same with the invasion of Gobo Khan, you know, you sacrifice it, give all of your creatures uh, hexproof and indestructible end of until end of turn, very darn freaking tasty. And we do have the new card, Get Lost. I think it is pretty darn good. Giving someone two map to, uh, tokens can be good for them if they're like a sacrifice deck, you know, something like that. But still, it is a new card. I want to play it. It has a cool name. Hey, you know, these map tokens also, you know, are they better than, I don't know, drawing a card? I don't know. We, we have to find out during the new meta when it freaking happens. And uh, yeah. Is there anything else that I uh, that I want to talk about, by the way? Oh, yeah, okay. And um, that is it. Yeah, that is it. <laughs> that is the deck. <laughs> it is absolutely insane. Once more. Like, this, together with this, absolutely crazy. These two cats are very good friends. Even though they're from different planes and one is a demon and the other one is a noble, they're bestest friends forever. Elspeth also helps you to give something flying to get over the top, you know. And uh, later on, you can just minus it to bring every single thing back that you lost, apart from everything starting here. But we still have a lot of things here. So, the Galta, you know, once more, it's a very fun card, together with the Jetmir, together with the OG attack. Pretty darn tasty. Pretty darn freaking tasty. So, thank you all so very freaking much. I hope you enjoy this new deck. Uh, we will see how it fares in the real meta. We will see that. I still have like five more deck decks to do. So yeah, a little bit shorter than per usual or exactly the right length. You tell me. And when we're back with the new set live, my studio will also be done. And then uh, there will be some pictures. Just all I'm freaking saying. So yeah, this is Cat Attack. I'm Matches Malone and I will see you in those Nomen games. We're up against Bina Wee! Oh, I forgot to change my, my avatar here. I will have to do that later. You please remind me. I mean, if we draw land, we're super happy. Hello! Oh my lord, it is mono red! <laughs> it is mono red! <laughs> and here I was to say, you know, there's no way we're playing Apple against mono red, you know? I mean, hey. Wait, how much does it get? I mean, it's pretty good. So they have an answer to this, eh? Right away. It's going to be bad. Pretty bad. Oh my lord. Tomb Raider here. No blockage. Are you shooting it now? I hope they're not. Resolute reinforcements. Okay. No attacks, of course. I mean, yeah. That would just be, you know, not that smart. How many more of those do you have? Like, how many more? How many freaking more, man? Okay. The so two, four, five, six, seven. I mean, we're blocking one more of those. All right. Let's gain two life. I hope we're still alive, question mark. I mean, you know, this is pretty good. This is pretty good. So, yeah. We're pumping the squad, we're doing everything we have to do here. Just attacking him with this. I mean, that's alright. We we survive here, you know. We absolutely freaking survive here. Let's check out uh, what they're doing here. Um, 
The Wandering Emperor needs to go. Then I will be attacking here like this. This can just also go here. It doesn't even really matter. Gaining the life. Putting the counter on it. I mean, this looks pretty good, you know? This looks pretty darn good. Like, right now, I'm not that scared. Maybe a little bit mama hold me, but not that super scared, you know? Alright, this makes sense. We're still fine. We will just be slamming down the virtue. Still getting more, you know? Hey, I mean, it was pretty... Yeah, yeah, okay. I mean, hey, that is <laughs> just... <laughs> yes. I had fun. Man, this deck is crazy already, you know? That is crazy already. I'm very happy. Get crushed, man. <laughs> Yo, thank you so much once more, Lord Sephiroth, for all the gifted subs. That's like 16 today. Oh, we're going first. Oh, my Lord Krimus. Yes, Krimus, my friend. Really like the hand. It's a little bit slow, though. Well, we will draw into good stuff, won't we? We will just draw into good stuff. Oh my lord, this is freaking gorgeous. Look at it. I forgot to change the avatar again. Oh no. Please remind me, chat, that I absolutely need to change the avatar after this. Alright, here's the Gala Greedus now. We'll go for the treasure here, actually. You think we're in a mirror match? Well, it looks like uh, some sort of dinosaur deck. Okay. Uh, going for the treasure token here. Always stay hydrated, my friends. I mean, this already looks very mana screw, you know? I mean, we do have all the colors. That, in the end, is all that matters. Alright, dinosaurs will be coming. Dinosaurs will be coming. Yeah, the token synergy. Okay. Alright. Uh, let's put down a counter here. If they want to block this, that is fine with me, you know? Absolutely is. Like, I will be bringing down King Darren next turn. If we can get the uh, Rebel Rousing, maybe I should not have attacked in. <laughs> maybe I shouldn't have attacked in. I was a little bit greedy to get rid of that dinosaur, but hey. Cavern or Souls is also pretty darn good. But you know, with all the non-cat creatures that we have in here. Um... Alright. That's in a turn. So one more land and we can go for the Rebel Rousing, which would be absolutely prime freaking beef. They just, okay, all right, yeah. I mean, why not, you know? You, you can do that. You can absolutely do that. But if you attack in, I would just destroy your life, man. Just destroy it. Does this have anything? No, it doesn't. We just have to block Gishta here. All right. I mean, that's all pretty darn good. But this is one. They can look at one card here. Was that really worth it? I don't know, man. I really, really don't know. So we're slamming it with cats. I mean, right now we haven't seen too many new cards. You know, it happens. It happens. But we're still doing them dirty with cats. <laughs> still doing them dirty. <laughs> 160 people on both platforms. Thank you so very much. Also, okay, a stream. There will be more freaking stream very, very soon. So let us see what they're doing here. Oh, yeah, that will be coming in my dinosaur deck as well. Like 100 freaking percentiles. One hundred freaking percentiles. So, I need one more mana for the Rebel Rousing. So, 
So I'm absolutely sad that I uh, threw away my win here with when I attacked in with the Gala Greeters. Should not have done that. Absolutely not. Alright, let us see how they're attacking. Only with you. And you, and you? Peculia. Are we winning here? We win, right? <laughs> we just win here, right? <laughs> On the swing back! Too greedy, my friend! Too freaking greedy! Good game! Good game indeed! The greed! The greed, man! Oh! You're running the stream over your Samsung fridge? Damn! <laughs> that is pretty cool. <laughs> no pun intended. Get out of here. We're up against Jay Villain, a good friend as well. So, um, he did me dirty. Yeah, yeah, yeah. They did. They did. So, we have a nice curve here. Let's do it. Man, this field looks so good. So freaking good. Hello, friendly waver of the hand. We don't have the friendly waver, so we have to do it like this. Alrighty. Oh my lord. You get out of here. Holy smokes. Um. Bringing down you here. So dinosaurs will be a theme. Yo, Papel, how are you doing? Do you like the new planeswalkers? Yeah, the new planeswalker will be pretty darn cool, to be honest. Um, I will be attacking you here. This will also be attacking here. They kind of have to block, you know? Oh my lord, they don't? Okay, alright. Then it's pretty fine with me. Not gonna lie about it. Wait, this doesn't count as attacking? Get out of here, game. <laughs> Get out of here. <laughs> it doesn't count as attacking, man. All right, Topiary Stumperino coming down. That's just crazy, man. Been running Gruel Dinosaurs for a long time. Oh, come on. I need this. Absolutely freaking need it. I mean, look at this now. Just look at it. Just, just look at it. It's pretty darn disgusting. <laughs> It's, it's, it's pretty darn disgusting what just happened, man. <laughs> man, what just happened? What, what just happened, man? I didn't even realize that it was so brutal. Oh my lord. Did we just put like eight counters on? Oh my god. What, what just happened? <laughs> what just happened? <laughs> meow, baby! Meow! Should have, I could have. Alright, we're up against Crusader JB. Opponents going first. I mean, hey, you know. Let's just hope that we look at these dinosaurs coming down like this. <laughs> it's so funny. <laughs> it is just so freaking funny. Let's give a friendly hello, waver of the hand. Also, today we're celebrating like... Oh, come on, really, Talia? Hey, what even is this? Ah, oh, come on, get out of here. Get freaking out of here. Also, we're celebrating... Um, Decklist will be up the moment that uh, the video comes out. So, look forward to that. Alright. Yep. Happens. Just happens. I think we lost here because they were just a little bit faster than we were. But at least we can be blocking here now, so that is already very darn good. And they might just be attacking in here. Okay. They're attacking with everything. This will not give him the card, so I absolutely do this. 
Oh, it will still give him the card. Okay, all right. Okay, all right. Man, I think we're dead, Zo here. I don't want to be that guy, but I think we're absolutely freaking dead, Zo here. They were just a little bit faster than we were, man. Just a little bit freaking faster. Yeah. <laughs> Jetmir, man. I'm telling you, Jetmir is dominating. Like, they beat us more or less the same way we beat them last turn, man. That is just so crazy. So crazy, man. It's all right, you know. Losing the way you won, absolutely fine. Get out of here. We are up against Nameless Lamb. Okay. Or a Nameless Eam. Ooh. This is a nice hand. I would like to keep that. Thank you very much. Merfolk. Merfolk. Looks like Merfolk. We will see what we can do here. Like going second, obviously no good. All right. Exploring once more here. So we have an explorer, eh? Through the caves of Ixalan? My, I'm sorry, I'm sorry. <laughs> so. Maybe they kept the one lander? Nope, they didn't. Okay, all right. I mean, there was a chance, you know? There was a small and significant chance that they just kept the one lander. You never know, it happens. People do that kind, kind of crazy stuff sometimes. Sometimes they do. All right. So, I think I'm going to go with uh, land, pump this one up. Oh my, Jade likes Spelunka. I mean, they're going pretty ham. They, they, they're going pretty ham. But yeah, we, we will be there as well very soon, you know. We will be there very soon. We found another land here. No worries whatsoever. Ooh, Elspeth is pretty darn good. We'll be making a treasure. For now. Just a good old treasure. So we will see if they're exploring more, if they're whatever they're doing here. Um, this already gives vigilance. So I might be doing that, you know? There's a new card that I haven't read yet. Uh, whenever a creature control explores a land, you may put that land from your hand onto the battlefield tap. That is pretty good. But they have to explore a land for that to be good. Okay, all right. They should explore. Oh, they only explored for one. All right. What does this do? No blocks yet. Alrighty. Putting down the 1-1 one, one counter here. Attacking seems pretty useless. That is such a good card. Man, they're exploring so much! <laughs> Stop! Stop! <laughs> Stop it! Okay. They will never stop, do they? They will never freaking stop, will they? Okay. Destroying you here. Eaten by piranhas. Pretty annoying card here. Oh, my sweetest baby Jesus. I'm putting the counter on it. For now. If we can get this one down, I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm so happy. <laughs> I'm so happy. Hello, nerds, to you as well. Looking to try out new cards in my Celeste and the Human deck? There will be some. Okay. Another creature you control, so yeah. All right, I, I hope it was worth it. I hope it was freaking worth it. Let's destroy this one here. 
It is rather annoying, isn't it? Uh, passing the turn. Uh, making the treasure so that we can play Ogier here next turn, which would be pretty darn good, not gonna lie about it. I would like to do that, you know, playing the Ogier here finally. <laughs> I mean, it is the Ogier, you know. Enters the battlefield or attacks. Okay. All right. So, we will see how they're attacking in. Subterranean schooner. Mm -hmm, mm -hmm. All right, all right. They're just attacking in with everything. You get out of here. You get out of here. And I mean, you know, there's no way we will ever get rid of this, so let's just do it like this. I will have a lot of tokens next turn, so that is still alright, you know? And not a Gala Greeters, but we're doing this now. Okay, alright. Gaining the life. Now we're making three tokens. <laughs> Look at it! Isn't it beautiful? <laughs> now we're making three treasure tokens! Oh no, we're not. It's just creature tokens. Okay, it's just creature tokens. Thanks. I appreciate it. Very much appreciated. Very freaking much appreciated. Can this be blocked? No, it, it, it explores. Okay, alright. It just freaking explores. Man, that was just good. Um, Decklist, please, in the Discord. You can join the Discord by just putting in a little uh, exclamation mark Discord in the chat. So what does this do now? All right, okay. I don't think that Explorer will be doing too much, to be honest. I just don't think so. All right, Exploring Make Disappear. <gasps> they throw it away! They threw it and Make Disappear away! Oh my lord! Just imagine we would find the Rebel Rousing now. Just, I want you all to imagine that we find the Rebel Rousing now. <laughs> just, <laughs> just imagine. We would find the freaking rebel freaking rousing now. Wouldn't that be amazing? Oh, yes, it would. So, let's make some more tokens and gain some life here as well. Seems pretty much important. So, we're making three life linkers now, which is pretty darn good, you know. Uh, creating the treasure, putting down a counter. Uh, gaining two life. Oh my lord, this is just absurd. Absurd, my friends. Freaking absurd. I will be attacking him with you and with you because I really want to draw that card. And you know, we can always flip the OG attack as well. And I really want that card. So uh, before you at me and say, hey, you could have made more, you know, tokens here. Yeah, I know. I know how to play this game. So, it will be coming back as a cave now. Tapped though. We're drawing a card. <gasps> oh my lord. <laughs> oh my lord. <laughs> oh my lord. Okay, alright. Good game. Good game, my friend. They're attacking here like this. And they scoop. <laughs> Just imagine. <laughs> We would have put so many counters on this now. Oh, but they scoop! <laughs> We're up against dark streams. We are up against dark stream. Oh my lord, we go first, Krimus! Yes, Krimus. Uh, let's keep this one land and we're in this game. Like it was 1965. Whatever that means. Ooh, that is exactly what I'm talking about here. One land, all right. Um, oh my lord. <laughs> oh my lord. Okay, let's get rid of the dreams of steel and oil. Don't like seeing those, do I now? Wedding announcement. If they want to use a cut down on this, I'm fine with that, you know? 
I absolutely am. I think they will be just playing their own wedding announcement here. Like that's what I would be doing. But hey, you never know. We're going for the dreams of steel and oil. I would be getting rid of the jet me here, my friend. Nope, they don't. Alrighty. Ooh, okay, alright. Pretty good still. Attacking here. You know, one more land and we're in rather rousing territory, so that is pretty darn good. They have to play to get lost here. We're still one land away from... Perfect. <laughs> freaking perfect. <laughs> Just freaking perfect, man. Okay, what can we get? Uh, yes, please. I like that. Thank you very much. Alright, one cut. Do you have another one? They just have two cutdowns? Come on, man, really? Freaking really? So easy. So freaking easy sometimes. <laughs> just... Come on. Just come on, man. Alrighty. So what you doing now? Not playing it? You still have something else in hand? You still have another removal? Okay, alright. So let us see what we can find here. They have another removal in hand, by the way. Oh, okay. All right, I would like that. Thank you very much. So the most important part is that we are making a rebel rousing token. That is all I freaking care for. Okay. All right. Ending the turn. I wonder what they're doing now. The Wandering Emperor. Okay, all right. I mean, that's absolutely fine with me, you know? Because I know what's in here. Uh, yes, please. Okay, attacking you. We, we're good here, we're good. You know, we're good. I just would like to have this now also. Would be pretty darn tasty if we could get it. So, I think the game is pretty much over. There, there will be scooping. All your freaking spot removals didn't help you at all, did they now? Freaking did they now? Okay. Wedding announcement is up. We don't have trample yet, but we do have vigilance. So the two of you can go here, you go here. We will even be drawing a card, which is amazing. And next turn... Oh, we did have trampled that. I'm, I forgot about the cat, man. I forgot about the cat. Okay, all right. Yeah, but it looks pretty darn good to me. <laughs> it looks pretty darn good to me. There's even an Alice path now. So next turn, we would even get the Sovereign. Uh, but, you know, it's just too late. It is just too late. They don't have anything here anymore. Oh, token power. Token freaking power, man. Good game. Good game indeed bring down you here now we are attacking in having all the creatures in the known universe and uh shabwam that is a that is a lot of freaking damage <laughs> that's a lot of freaking damage man we don't even get to the double strike because they're all oh my lord it would have been a minus 20 and minus 52 oh my god oh my god it's Philippa! Oh, let's see what one of my best friends like brewed up here. Oh my lord, Krimus! Yes, Krimus. Absolute Krimus. Amazing. Freaking amazing. Hello! Alrighty. Dinosaurs, isn't it? It's dinosaurs. <laughs> it's dinosaurs. I can tell you that much. 100% dinosaurs. Okay. But I will be drawing a card here, so I'm happy with that. Am I though? Yeah, 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 yeah. Drawing the card here is very good. There's Galta now. There's the land now. Okay, alright. I like it. Jetmir as well. Uh, creating that tap treasure token. Oh no. <laughs> oh 
I feel like Galta will be coming down very darn soon, eh? Very, very darn freaking soon, eh? Um... Let us slam in. Ball in their court. Seems pretty good. Seems pretty, pretty good. I feel like Galta will be coming down next turn. One bajillion freaking percentiles. But we're also very close to winning here, so yeah. Oh, wait. Wait, what? Okay. Alright. Weird, but okay, alright. There's the lore keeper. And the growing rights. I think she should have kept the other one. Maybe there is no creatures, you know? Maybe there's just no freaking creatures. Can I do both? I can do both. Okay. I think we win here. Because I will just be putting down you here. Attack with everything, making a million creatures, giving and we win! Oh! Oh! We got him! We got him with the flying cat! Oh, delicious! I'm sorry, Philippe, if you're watching this. I'm sorry. I never meant to hurt you. But get out of here! That was me from the Early Access event. I hope you enjoyed the deck. Yes, this outro is the same as yesterday. Or if this is the first video where it's in, this will be the same outro in the next few days. Because I am done. I recorded so much, almost freaking, I would say about, you know, 10 to maybe 12 hours have been recorded. Uh, in these last, you know, 24 hours of uh, the early access event. So this is it. I'm done. Uh, I want to give a huge, huge freaking thank you to the Lord Sephiroth here at this point. Because Lord Sephiroth just like gifted, I don't know, 20, 25 memberships. So yeah, this one is for you right there. If you're not on the good God uh, Pharaohs list yet. That will all be happening. I have to refresh this list. Because there's way too many people, nobody will fit in here. So yeah, the shoutout will be here for the next six days. Because you deserve it, my friend. Or the last six days, depending if this is the last video. A huge shoutout though to all of my patrons and members. And of course my sponsor, Ultimate Guard, that helped me keep the lights on here at MTG. I said on here at MTG Malone. I appreciate it very, very freaking much. And hey, if you are still here and you haven't done so already, hey maybe you know subscribe to the channel and uh, put down a little nice comment down below i would appreciate it very freaking much just be creative my friend i know you can do it and remember that if you're waking up tomorrow morning and see a beautiful beautiful face of yours in the mirror that all of you are pretty freaking sweet i'm Max malone and i will see you all tomorrow